Hey everyone, welcome to Positron Plays Ghost Song. This is a uh, Metroidvania from Old Moon, uh, which I think is actually only a couple of developers. I know Matt White uh, has done a huge amount of work on this. I don't know the names of... Oh, you know what? Here we go, credits. Uh, I want to preface this a little bit with... Uh, I'm in a new space, so if the audio is weird, uh, I apologize. Uh, hopefully I have gotten that. So, oh yeah, there's there's quite a few people here. My, my apologies. And look at all those testers too. Um, yeah, so we're just gonna get into this. This, uh, this was actually originally on Kickstarter. It wasn't one that I backed, uh, but it was 2014. It's finally come out. I played a very, very early build of it back at PAX many, many years ago. I thought it was pretty cool. So I'm looking forward to it. Original or Explorer? Nah, we'll just go, we'll just go original. The dead suit. Quiet for many years. On this day, something stirs within. Something new. Poto. I guess assuming this is uh, maybe the planet we're on. Yeah, those little critters. <sighs> All right, up and at him. He's got to go left first. Maybe. <laughs> wow, this, I, I have to say, uh, the art was impressive when I first saw it. It is, it is even more impressive now. This is incredible. Are you friendly? What are you? You hurt me? You're not actually there. You seem. Yeah, you are. You are not friendly. Hmm. That seems to be some sort of currency. We do have a melee attack. Have a have like a naming mode. That's cool. It seems like I can just move the camera around too, which is pretty nice. Uh, do we have a map or anything? We do. It doesn't look like we have anything on it yet, though. It's nano gel. Hmm, interesting. You... I don't know if you're friendly or dangerous. Well, it actually helps us. Firing builds heat that can affect blaster performance. Does more damage the closer you are to the target. Well, that's interesting. So 28 there. Oh, I see you. So, we, how do we? Is heat just like cools off over time? How does that work? It's got a pretty long cooldown. So that's that's gonna be kind of interesting to see how that plays out. Can we can we cut you down or anything? No. Ah, the mapping unit. Perfect. Look at these little gamers. I did see the developer mentioned uh, Super Metroid as an influence, so. Hmm. 
Interesting. Oh, that does a lot of damage. That's actually... Oh no, it just... Did it do more damage while we were overheated? It does. That's very curious. Oh, we can combo too. I wasn't even thinking about that. Oh, we are just covered in goop. Hmm. Oh. Melee is stronger when you're overheated. Wow, it does so much damage, too. It's a really interesting mechanic. Must, that must be our SS flask. Surely I can get up there, right? How dare you? Well, we're going to make a mark there. Boy, this game is very, very nice to look at. I can probably I'm gonna to turn the audio up a notch. I think I'm actually gonna balance it. Let's try that. If I can probably even. So it seems like there's a lot of ambiance that I don't want to miss out on. Okay, so we actually can't melee while ducking. It automatically stands us up. It's good to know. I wonder if we get like a magnetize ability on these, uh, this currency stuff. I hope so. Oh, it does magnetize. Who or what are you, spirit? Can't open that. Am I supposed to be coming down here? Probably not. Well, this is this is way down here. I really should not be going this way. In fact, can I even get back? Oh, I can. Okay. Oh, they give you a little barrier there. Oh, that's a really nice touch. Uh, interestingly, there was another... Uh, one of those ghosts there. That's a really tough jump to make. Interesting too when they're when they're unbothered they kind of stop moving. Alright, let's let's check this left section here. 
because I might be missing something. Norberg Laboratory. Whoa. This doesn't cost us anything to repair. We can level up. Favored attribute. So we have gunpower, vigor, resolve. Okay, gunpower, vigor, and resolve. That's interesting. Resolve kind of, uh... Do we get to see how much? No, we just have to spend it. Hmm. Okay, that'll be interesting to to make decisions on. So these those are checkpoints, and also um, where's that icon? Oh. So that's the actual save point. I guess those are separate. Now we can just fall. I don't think we take falling damage. Spiky. Alright, I was gonna say that one looks particularly nasty. I got it though. Just loops back. Yeah. Well, that one came down. Might as well. Gets us more uh, nano gel, I think it was called. Nothing here, huh? Hmm, okay. I really like this. This is such a nice idea. Oh, and it's temporary too. That is actually very interesting. I guess you can't just use it as a safe point as well. Close. There's not an insignificant amount of damage. Is that a, it's almost a full heal. Wow. Oops. Why, yes, I have seen these enemies in, in Metroid before. These flea type enemies. Can I just melee these? Yeah, I can. Perhaps a little risky, though. Eh, maybe not. Oh, man, they, they do a lot of damage, even though they're tiny. They're kind of just trying to bait you to, to run into them. It's pretty interesting.
Oh, the laboratory. I feel like I'm walking into a very dangerous location. Huh. Well, don't seem to be able to get past. Oh, wait, hold on. This all seems extremely dangerous. Small nano jump cluster. Now, didn't the map say? Oh no, it's further, further to the right. Dash. Dash forward to avoid harm and reach new places. Your first dash grants a vulnerability for its duration. Okay, we can dash in midair. That's good to know. Medium nano jump coaster. I can jump from it though. Hmm. I wonder if. So I kind of want to try to find a save point too, you know? I guess we, I guess we can't do that. It's kind of hard to, to hear it some signs, but... say the little little mechanical sounds of the suit are a really nice touch I don't know I feel like does does falling down there do bad things I might just run back and save here and we'll we'll consider that the first episode no oh, I have to make it through here though oh we've also got uh, really dangerous enemies That's not good. You know what? Can I just run past you? Nuts. <laughs> so 
So what happens now? We look like we might be, be damaged. Ah, uh, yeah, okay, so we've got uh, a little bit of a... Uh, where do our... Can we go pick up our, our items, I wonder? Yeah, okay, so we've got a, a double Dark Souls mechanic here. We've got a... Uh, we do drop our, our nano gel, but also it looks like we get a max health debuff um, from from dying. I think that was a uh, that was Dark Souls 2 that did that. We've already got enough to repair it though, so that's not so bad. Now that being said, fighting this enemy that we have to to dodge projectiles seems potentially pretty tough. All right, nice. What do we got? Fishmaster's glow. Huh. Causes healing injections to also regenerate energy. Oh, that's that's what an interesting balance. So to to install these, we have to we have to shut down. Which means we can't just do it on the fly. We have to have a little bit of a safe moment. Clever balancing. Because it makes sense in the world, right? Alright, this guy. I'm assuming we can hit him from the from the back. Ah, oh, damn. Oh, it's really tough. Well, maybe we'll try and figure out how to how to defeat that next time. Maybe we're not even supposed to. But I think we got our stuff, right? So I think we, we should be good with that. But uh, I'll make another, another quick save here. And uh, we'll continue this next time. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. And I'll see you soon.